Hi honey bunnies, welcome back, it's me Jenny. How is all my crafty friends doing today? Okay honeys, we are going to be making a really simple, easy, quick DIY little mini cards for Mother's Day. Um, I am making some of these really adorable, tiny note cards for a few of my friends. And I just needed to make a few, but I wanted to show you what I was working on. This is the first one that I created. It's so pretty, right? I love it. Gorgeous. So cute. You got these really pretty butterflies and then this dimensional little Mother's Day sticker with the little corner sticker here. And then I added a really pretty um, tea and coffee dyed application in the back. So this is just a super, super cute and adorable little mini note card. Um, here you have this really pretty basket and the little tiny, you can't really see it, but it says a special lady. And again, with some pretty little butterflies. And I also attached a little um, application in the back, okay? So I'm going to be making three more of these little mini cards and I'm going to show you guys how I make these very simple and easy cards, okay? So the first thing, let's talk about the papers. I'm using this paper pack from Wild Rose Studio. I absolutely love this company. I have no idea. This company has so much beautiful paper, but I definitely am going to be um, looking for more paper pads from this company. They have the most beautiful, gorgeous papers you can ever see in your life. Um, so I'm using this pad for my little mini note cards. And I'm using the, you know, simple um, three, what is this, three by three? Yeah, three by three little envelope from Michaels. I'm making my own little note card, so I don't really need a note card, but I do need an envelope, okay? I mean, you can very easily make these if you know how to, or if you have like the, the envelope, um, the envelope little gadget that shows you how to make them. I have that upstairs, but I've, I've never used it. Um, I'm also going to pick some of these beautiful um, butterflies that I got last week at Joann's, okay? So some ribbons and some stickers, just the general thing that we always use for little note cards, okay? So let me bring you in closer so you can have a better view of how I create these really simple note cards, okay? So I'm using my little application that I like to um, tea and coffee dyed. I'm going to have a video coming up soon showing you guys or at least not showing you but like giving you ideas and tips on how I get my um you know my applications and my ribbons and all my little like junk journal gadgets how I get them this color when I coffee and tea dye them okay that's coming up soon hopefully that can help some of you um with the questions that you're asking me um and then, so I'm gonna use these, which are so pretty, some ribbon, some stickers, and that's basically it, okay? So I already picked out the paper that I'm going to use for this little project. Um, the paper is six by six. All I did was I took a six by six paper, I cut it in half, and then on this half, I folded my little note card. That's all I did. I didn't do anything else, okay? So, now that we have our little note cards here on the little side, let's um, let's work on it, okay? So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to add this little application onto the note card, okay? I love these applications. They're just so pretty and they look so like vintage and I don't know, it's just, like, to me it's appropriate for this particular project. So pretty and I, I love it, I love it. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put a little bit of hot glue on all four corners, okay, of this little application. Because you don't want it really be too heavy with the hot glue, because you don't want it to leak, you know, go through your paper. So you wanna be a little bit light with the hot glue. Um, you can also use, um, you know, like wet glue. That also is not a bad idea, okay. If you don't want to use hot glue I like my hot glue so 
I'm always gonna I'm always going to be uh, always going for the hot glue even if I have like wet glue I don't know I always seem to go for the hot glue for some reason okay so make sure these are really neatly you know all um, glue down okay just like that and let's do the other two well this is done okay put a little bit of application in the center and then I'm gonna put this sideways I have to put it sideways because that's the only way that it's going to fit in my little mini card it's not gonna fit any other way so it has to go sideways but if you have like a regular size card um, this would be really pretty for it, a regular size card too. Okay, gonna have some hot glue here. Glue this down. And there goes the second one. And I hot glue this part over here because this is sticking out too much for me. Okay. There you have it. See that? How pretty, right? And then the last one we have here. I'm gonna put it right there in the center. Oh, I'm off frame. Sorry. Right there. Put some hot glue. Okay. Right there, some hot glue over here. And some hot glue over here. And there you have it. That's so cute. See that? With a little bit of detail, your little note card is gonna come out so absolutely lovely. Look at that little little tiny application how cute that looks i love it right so pretty nice right okay perfect now that we have that all done let's look at our stickers okay that i have here let's see which one we're going to use for which one so what i want to do is before i add the stickers let's cut out a little bit of the ribbon okay because i want to add some ribbon onto my my little note card so let's cut out three little pieces of ribbon not too big you don't want this to be too big because remember the mini note cards are tiny and you want to make sure that you can put them inside the envelope okay so you don't necessarily need a huge one okay so here I have three little pieces of ribbon right for my three little note cards okay so let's cut these in half because what i want to do is i want to add these roughly around here just like that okay i might have to cut this one a little bit more that's okay we can do that okay let's cut this in half and we're gonna do the same thing with this one. We're gonna put it like this, and we're gonna put it like that. And we're gonna do the same thing with this one. We are going to put this like this, and then we're gonna add this one like that. See that? So that kind of gives you like a really pretty tail. So let's hot glue that down first before we do anything else. And you can take any ribbon, you can take any twine, um, you can really take anything. It doesn't have to be ribbon, it could be twine, it could be fabric, it could be lace, it could be trims. Okay, this one I want to cut a little bit more because I feel that it's a little bit too long, okay? So we did that. Let's add this right here. And let's add this one uh, right there. Okay. And 
and then let's do the same thing with this one. Now this is going to make our little sticker look really pretty. Okay? And it's going to show such a pretty look. You'll see. You'll see. Okay, now that we have a ribbon all put down, let's get our stickers and figure out where we want to put everything, okay? Where we want to place everything. So I have these that are left over. So I'm definitely going to use this mom on one of these, okay? Um, we're going to use obviously this little basket on another one, okay, and then this one it says home is where your mom is. I'm going to use on this one right here, okay. So, you see that how pretty those look already. But I have these these little edge like these little flowers. So I'm gonna actually add one of these little flowers onto this one right here. Okay. I'm going to add the other one, which is this little bigger one, and I'm gonna add actually this one. Mm, no, let's add this one down here. Okay, just like that. And then for this one, we can probably add perhaps maybe a pretty uh, butterfly there. We can add another butterfly on this one right here. And maybe we can add a butterfly right here. Maybe even like this. Mm. Yeah, like that. Maybe this one we can add like that. Yeah, see that? So that already looks already really, really pretty. I love it. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hot glue this down. And we're almost done, guys. <clears throat> you see how simple that was, right? Okay, so let's hot glue this down. Although this has adhesive in the back, I never trust that adhesive. I always like to hot glue it down just to make sure that it does not fall out because that would be super embarrassing if your embellishments fall out so i like to add some hot glue to it and that would give me some security that it's not going to go anywhere and then let's hot glue this beautiful one back let's put this right between this and the butterfly and boom there you have the first mini card finished i love it okay i'm gonna show you guys up close in a minute okay let's do this one next okay so let's hot glue this sign that says home is where your mom is i'm gonna put this right here and then i'm gonna add Let's see, should we put it here? Should we put it here? I think we should put it here. Just like that. And this is basically done. See how easy but how cute these cards are? All right, let's do the last one. I really like this one. Uh-oh. Hold on, I gotta get more hot glue. Okay, more hot glue. This is gonna go in the center. This one, this little tiny butterfly, it's gonna go right here. And then this one is gonna go right in the side. Right here. So that doesn't interfere with the envelope. And there you have it, guys. There you have a complete look on all these adorable little mini cards. I love them. They're so freaking beautiful. I just love them. I'm going to write a little message inside each one for my friends. 
okay? But overall, this is the finished look to it. Look how gorgeous these little mini Happy Mother's Day cards are. Aren't these cute? This is the first one we created. This is the second one we created. I really like this one. This is really pretty. I love the butterfly. And I love the, the doily, or not, it's not really a doily, it's more like an application. I love how it peeks out in the background. It just really gives it a really pretty, like vintagey look, okay? And then this one is the last one that we created. Got all these little strings of glue that needs to be cleaned out. But overall, look how pretty this looks. How adorable is these mini note cards? So cute, right? All right, honeys. And that's basically how I create my little mini Mother's Day note cards in no time. You saw how quickly that was, right? You guys know me. I like to do things easy and as less complicated as possible. Okay, my loves. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy watching me make these adorable little tiny handmade mini tags i mean not tags cards i'm going to be making tags actually next so the next video that i'm going to be doing is going to be a tutorial on gift tags because i have to make some for some of my friends so i will be doing that for you guys soon make sure you guys subscribe make sure you thumbs up um if you guys try to make these cute little tags or cards or, you know, little mini note cards, make sure you tag me in Instagram so I can take a look, take a look and see how awesome your work is. And yeah, and I hope you guys just have fun making these little adorable mini cards. Have a fantastic weekend, my lovies. I will see you soon and I will come back again with another video soon. Bye.